Hello and welcome to Hobby Electronics and I'm Nick and on this episode I'll be showing you how to make a solder fume extractor so let's get to it. Okay so the things that you'll be needing for this project are an old computer fan, some wire, two 9 volt battery clips and batteries, some strong tape, a sheet of thick cardboard and a switch and a 12 volt voltage regulator. Okay so the first step in this build is to measure your fan and draw it on a piece of cardboard. Once you've done this, do it three more times and cut them out. Okay, so now I've cut out all of my pieces and I've painted them black. Now I'm just attaching them to the fan with some hot glue and some tape. Okay, so now it's on to the electronics. And the first step that you're going to take is to solder the positive of one 9 volt battery clip to the negative of the other. So now you're going to solder a short wire to one of the legs on the switch and then solder the other positive battery clip wire to the switch. Okay, so now this is what we've done so far. I've got the spare negative lead down there, then we have our join of our positive and negative from each battery clip, and then we have our switch with the positive lead for the battery clip going to the center. And now you need that spare wire coming off the switch to go to the left hand leg of the voltage regulator. Then get another small piece of wire and solder it to the negative lead coming from the battery clip. And then solder them to the centre leg of the voltage regulator. Then solder a short piece of wire to the right leg of the voltage regulator. This is going to be used for attaching the fan. Okay, so now I've got two wires coming off the voltage regulator that aren't being used yet. So the right one there is going to be for the positive side of the fan, and the left one is the negative side. And now I'm just going to attach those wires coming from the voltage regulator to the fan. Okay, so I've got a piece of black tape attached to the center leg of the voltage regulator just to stop the other two legs from touching it. And I've got the switch with the two wires attached to it. Wired up the fan there. I'll probably put a bit of tape around those leads going to the fan. And there's the two battery clips. Okay, now it's time to do a test. I'll just flick the switch in the bottom right hand corner. You'll be able to see the fan start. There you go. Fan's spinning. It's actually got a fair bit of suction there. Suck away those solder fumes. And there we go, just slowing down and stopped. And thanks for watching Hobby Electronics. Mm -hmm.